Good afternoon, everybody. This is NCP. <clears throat> I wanted to mention something. This weekend, we were out at a, a, a Mexican restaurant, and I got some, uh, you know, Coke Zero, or tried to. And um, <clears throat> let me adjust this. There we go. Some Coke Zero, and um, it tasted really sweet to me, like way, way too sweet. And I said, you know, that's that's not right. And she's like, oh, yeah, that's right, right. And I said, well, I don't know. You know, and, and since I do diabetic things and I have to dose for my carbs, and this is pure carb, I only have this here in case I've had an insulin incident or a low sugar incident. I don't drink this, but this one I drink. Now I want to show you how you can check. Um, and the restaurant, it was the wrong one, just so you know. But I want to show you the difference. I always carry a, a glucometer with me in the car, backpack, whatever. I always have one just in case my my Dexcom, that's a sensor in my arm, fails. So this is what I have. It's the uh, One Touch Ultra. Now there, I'll link to a web page that'll tell you what the readings are for your meter. Um, but let's say you want to do keto, hardcore keto. It's like one. This this will probably knock you out of keto. It's one little or this one I guess. One little four ounce thing of this is pure sugar. So what you do is you take your strips for your meter. Whatever meter you have. Okay. Like I said, I carry these around. These are the mini strips. And uh, give me a second. Let me pop this out of the case. Hold on. All right. So here it is. We're going to go ahead and put it on. Now, there's different modes. Sorry. There's different modes you can do. To uh, protect these, okay, turn this on. Not coming out again. I think the batteries are dead. She's on the car. Hold on, let me let me sure get this thing on. Okay, so ignore that. Now you can do these things in test mode so they don't affect your average. I don't care anymore. I don't use this. Even the date's wrong. But if you put this in here and you dunk them, they'll show you that. Well, whether you have it. So here on mine. It'll error out, which means extremely low, okay, or low in this case. The other one said error, but still low, right? Now, watch when I put it in regular Coke. Let me change the, the sensor out, or the, uh, the test strip. And like I said, if you're doing keto, this is uh, pretty good. You'll know if you get the wrong kind of Coke or not. So let me go ahead and put it in. The meter comes on. <clears throat> See 25 strip. I put it in here. Submerge it. And it'll come out high. See that? So I'll know for sure whether you get you know sugar free or not. Uh, as like I said, as a diabetic, if I'm dosing for say 30 carbs for my meal. And I, I have this, oh boy, you know, gee, why is my, my sugar at 500 or 600 or whatever? So it's just important to know, um, if you're doing, like I said, if you're doing keto, you know, you'll, you'll know this will not, this will knock you out of keto or keto, or nutritional ketosis, but this will not. And, but they taste extremely different. I don't care what anybody says, but I don't, I don't ingest sugar, you know, I'm diabetic, I keep it. Last time I checked it, you saw like 79 or whatever. Uh, the dates are all screwed up on these things anyway. But there you go. See that high? And this one here was this other one down there showed low. So that's a quick tip if you're doing keto or you're doing um, <clears throat> me, any not 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 just Coke brand uh, any uh, any brand. So sugar free versus not sugar free. Um, so you know, hey, this is a big deal I found out. I'll put a link below to a page I learned this from. I don't know, whenever I learned it from. I don't know, a long time. Or at least the current one. I just know for this meter. But each meter will have different readings. Sometimes I get the ERR4. Uh, if, I, if I dip it in there with my finger or straw, it's, it doesn't come out as strong. But when you put it in like that, you know. That's beyond this meter scope, and I don't know how high this meter goes 
I think it was a 400 or 500. Um, <clears throat> I don't like to, I don't, I don't use these for diagnosis anymore. I use them for backup. Um, and you know, like once in a long time, I'll calibrate my Dexcom sensor, which is an implantable kind of sensor, semi-implantable. I don't know. It's just a lot more convenient. I don't, I don't like poke my fingers. I now have a uh, feeling back to my fingers because I haven't poked in so long. But this, this is a, a game changer for diabetics or keto. Um, and there's also human error. Just because you fill it from yourself from the fountain and you choose Diet Coke or sugar free or whatever, it doesn't mean the boxes underneath the machine are fixed. Human error, you know, these labels look a lot alike. Um, on the boxes anyway, if you're not paying attention, they could do the wrong one. And to a lot of people, these taste the same. To me, they don't. It tasted weird. Now, my sister says that they're different colors. I don't see much of a different color there, to be honest. Watch me spill this all over my ham equipment here. You know, let's not be lazy. They look the same color to me, but... I think if you just have enough ice in there, or if they cut it or something, you know, you know, you don't know, <laughs> you know, but, but, with this method, you know. Now, <clears throat> some meters test, uh, um, what do you call it, hemocrit, and they might not work for this, but, I think when I, my first meter I got, I got whatever one had the, the cheapest strips. I don't know what these strips cost, because I haven't bought them in a long time. And when I did, I had insurance for them, so, I don't know, but there, there's 15 here, and they come like packs of 100, but that's just this one meter, like you said, I will link to a page that has all kinds of meters for it, um, yeah, so, there you go, that's a, a really important life hack, pro tip, whatever, for diabetics, because, like I said, you come back, and it's like, I don't know why my sugar's 500, it's, it's dangerous, you know, if you make a mistake and you're, you're playing with insulin and hormones and all that good stuff. But, you know. Alright. Well, this is NCG. That's my tip for the day. I've got to get on to the contesting on the ham radio this weekend. Which I think is Monday, so that probably didn't happen. But whatever. I'm going to go play on the radio anyway. <laughs> Alright, guys. NCP. You have a great one. NCP out.